<laughs> the battlefield out here. Oh my god, you sons of bitches! Sons of bitches! woke up during daylight hours, ran some er errands, I had to buy a, a new headlight for my truck and some other stuff. So I decided to take advantage of the daylight and we're gonna go uh, soak up soak up the sights. So we're just gonna go over to uh, Coronado, take the bridge up, right through kind of do like a little scenic thing I think I might do that for for some of the spots around here just go out and check them out make that the topic of conversation for the uh, for the vlogs these are the uh, the bridges where people fucking fly off of apparently not too long ago and I think it's happened a few times Fucking cars just drive off that fucker right into that park. I know they killed some people a few months ago. Check out the view right here, man. Check this shit out. Ain't this the shit right here? I'm really sad to be leaving this place. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Coronado's inhabited by mostly uh, affluent uh, white people, basically. Real expensive to live here, even if you got a little shack. You know, they because they think they're on a fucking island and they're like so fucking cool. This fucking view is awesome, especially at night when the city lights up. It's beautiful here. Look at this. Beautiful, ain't it? And that's it. <laughs> Lately, I haven't been wanting to drink any craft beers. They give me a fucking headache for some reason now. I was all about the craft beers, you know, especially living here in San Diego. You got so much selection. They're, they're, they're strong beers and they just fucking take a toll on your stomach. When you wake up, you take the... the the nasty shits, <laughs> headache and all that. So I just stick to like the basics now, like Pacifico. I love Pacifico. But I might, I might do some Taco Tuesday today. Have a Pacifico and some tacos. Yeah, the houses here are unbelievable. Like shit that I have no idea how anybody can afford. like dream homes I don't want to go into the naval base and get myself six stars this hotel Dell pretty cool place it's a pretty old as hotel it's supposed to be haunted and stuff so I think I'm gonna go cruise over to my local Harley Davidson <laughs> fuck that shit I don't know why people go to Harley Davidson so much fucking lame in there the fucking old fart standing around they don't even fucking work there they're just lurking that's one thing they don't tell you about buying a Harley from fucking Harley Davidson dealership is that they're a bunch of cocksuckers and they're gonna fuck you over especially when you don't know anything about bikes
lane splitting needs to be legalized nationwide. It's such a beauty, especially in, in stop and go traffic. Is, and especially if you have an air-cooled engine, like on the Harleys, or those riders out there who will ruin it for everybody and you know just split at 100 miles an hour when everybody's doing 80 you know but that's here in California I mean most people have become aware that we're coming through you know just to watch out and that's all people need to do just fucking look twice before sh changing lanes it would make lane splitting safer for everybody how are you gonna wait until I'm right here to turn oh my god fucking people and remember guys to subscribe and hit like and comment if you want to see other stuff